God, Dad, what the heck? Good Lord. You boys are going to cause a whole neighborhood to go deaf. Yeah, but we got to practice. Well, you damn sure need it. Asshead. <laughs> <laughs> What's it about? It's about it's the music. George. George? George. Oh, sorry. Are you sitting there when I came in? Must have had the headphones a little loud. I, I just got the bids in from the contractors for the kitchen and the condo. Yeah. Maybe we could go over them this weekend. Well, I thought we'd go for a long weekend, and I could walk you through everything. Sure. Later this month? Well, I, I don't want to put it off much longer. Kind of in the middle of a couple projects right now. The condo's downtown. The business park's hit a snag. <sighs> you know, I've been working hard to, to make this nice for us. You know, Ellie's going to be off to college. We, we don't need this big house. If we're going to be empty nesters, I, I prefer the beach. I suppose, if that's what you want. You know, about this, um, 25th high school reunion? I think you should go. Have a good time. Yeah, it's something different. You might have fun. No. I mean, just you go. I'm not from there, and I don't know these people from Adam. Well, it's not like I'd leave you alone. Well, that's my point. I mean, you haven't been to a reunion since we were married. All you do is worry that I'd be bored. If you think it'd be a drag, okay, but... as long as it's your decision... I'm happy either way. I don't know why you'd want to go. An old buddy called the office, invited me down. Figured, what the hell, it's only 70 miles. Might be fun to surprise him. Well, I guess you'll have a lot of catching up to do. Or some lying to do. You painted the walls ivory. The windows came in last week. Watch that plastic. Now, the schedule got thrown off because of the sprinkler system installation. You know, there were also some issues with the electricals to be resolved, so they decided to hold off. What else? Well, the ceilings had to wait until the line tests were complete. George, look, I don't like rumors, but some of our contractors are worried about our cash flow. Tell them not to worry. You guys manage the project, I'll deal with the bank. Look, George, telling them not to worry won't cut it. According to McGraw, he hasn't been paid for a couple weeks. All right. We're at the top of our line on this project, so we've let payment go to full term. These guys are just used to a quick turnaround of invoices from us. You could have shared that with us. Look, if you don't give us some accounting information to make them more comfortable, they'll give some other jobs priority, and that'll put us even further behind schedule. I'll have Glenn put it together for you. We're going to need to be able to ask Glenn for it directly, George. You got it. So why do they always have to change great songs? Because the times are a-changing, Mr. B. Yeah, my dad's into originals, but I think they're boring. <laughs> oh, there's my mom. All right, bye. Thanks for the ride. All right, Thank take you. care, Alec. Yeah. I'll call Night, you when I get home. It wasn't really that bad. Oh, uh, a little loud, don't you think? And seriously, don't you ever get tired of DJs? They play the best songs. Yeah, but a live band has energy. High school bands are like 10 songs. We knew. Uh, at least 40 and a couple new ones every week. You've been talking to Grandma again. <laughs> well, tell me this. Did you have a good time? For sure. More than good. Oh, Alan asked me to a party next weekend. Alan is from what planet? He's a nice guy. And he has a really cool little sports car. That's supposed to make me feel better. He's a safe driver. No, Alan's a new driver. I'm a safe driver. Pop, you worry too much. Well, you're right about that. But he really is a nice guy. And you like him because he plays the guitar. Now, that does make me feel better. At least I know his hands will be busy. Dad!
Just so you know, Grandma said your band was totally amazing. So Grandma's a critic now, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> when I saw her last weekend, she said you won a radio station songwriting contest. Her memory must be failing her. Something about a notebook? I might have scratched out a few, but that was a long time ago. <laughs> you know, when you were three, you promised me you'd never grow up. Oh, and you promised to write me a song. I can still keep my promise. <laughs> I'll always be your little girl. Promise. Come on. Is your hip feeling better? Better than a kick in the head. <laughs> yeah, you new therapist, he seems to know what he's doing. You'll be dancing on the table at the next party. I'm dancing no matter what, baby. <laughs> I sure hope I got your jeans. Oh, some, but some came from your dad. He worked too hard, too. You should be glad he did. Mm -hmm. His retirement all planned out. Well, he could have had a little more fun along the way. Anyway, he missed out on all this. <laughs> Things uh, improving with that woman? We've been married 20 years, Ma. You can call her Pamela. Oh, good idea. Oh, Ellie stopped by last week. Thank God she's got your sense of humor. You know, that woman is as serious as an end, Ma. Are you happy, Georgie? Yeah. I give it a 7 out of 10. Huh. Those last three are the hardest. And the reason is? Because you need to be a little selfish. Just put yourself first. Hey, I'm going to my 25th high school reunion this weekend. <laughs> that went fast. Is that, uh, that woman go? Wouldn't be much fun for her. So, I hear you mention my song notebook to Ellie. Well, I've got to get ready for casino night. So, Scoot, go have some fun. Hey, don't lose my inheritance. Oh, I wouldn't dream of it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Mom. I love you, baby. Don't stick that in your thumb. <laughs>
25. The song? No, years and pounds, man. Come on. 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 Hey, 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 look at this. I got a mic for you. Come on. Just sing. Just sing. It's right over here. Like old times, huh? Kind of felt like a lifetime ago to oh, me. Nutty, yeah. the voice is still there. You've been singing in the shower. You've been talking to my wife? Nah, your wife doesn't talk about you when we're together. Is she here? Oh, crap, is she here? She was ill. <laughs> oh, thank God. Yeah, I'd like to meet the one that hooked you, Georgie boy. <laughs> yeah, but that's, uh, that's where we speak for a hell of a job. Come on, man, crowd loved you. Hey, hey, hey Chuck, up? what's up? <laughs> Hey, that was a hell of a fullback. Hey, was it one uh, time? I remember he hit that boy from Boyd hey, County that time. Hey, oh, football team's doing good. Yeah. Hey, brother, can we get another round? Yeah. Lefty, you want a beer? Sure. Yeah. Did you see? Yeah. Yeah. Holy yeah. cow. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. <clears throat> was that? I like high school reunions. That's summer. That was summer, Take right? Summer. So okay. how long you guys been back together? Oh, about five, five years. years I think. Yeah, I'm the only one who never stopped playing. Yeah, well, some of us have families, you know? We got to make a living. Yeah, you, you, got, need, you got a you little need, something on your glass. You need a happy pill or something. <laughs> Still the moody artist, huh? I think he's frustrated. Playing here with us, gigging in studios. Well, that's not a bad way to make a living if you can swing it. Yeah, well, I think he's got other sources of income. Oh, you think? <laughs> hey, Just come on. What's it about? It's, it's about, about the, the music. music. Yes, it is. Yeah. Let's go over there. Let's mm. go. you come by Stevie's Tuesday night jam with us. Go through some notes. There you go. We rehearse everything we messed up the last gig, which is pretty much just everything. about everything. <laughs> come on, man. It'd be fun. It'd be fun. No yeah. way. No way. Now, Georgie's got a big business to run. The music ain't his thing anymore, huh, Georgie boy? Ah, it's not like his full time. Come on. How about ask me when you're so? Like, three rehearsals, you'd be right back into it. Yeah, but the fingers are 25 years old. Come on, man, what do you got to lose? Just my self-respect. Hey. <laughs> you guys are as good as anybody I've heard around here in a long time. Is that a compliment, man? Yeah, you guys sounded fresh. You sounded together. 
I had Freddy come by to take a listen. He might have a gig we might be right for. I believe that when it happens. Hmm. Freddy Wilson. George Barron. I remember you managing some groups when we were kids. Oh, I'm feeling ancient. You are, man. Hey, new blood adds energy, huh? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, you're right. It's crazy. You know, we've hung in a long time, Georgie boy. You see a lot of bands. They folded. Oh, my God, would you please hey, shut Guys, up. guys, all right, stop. guys, hey, guys. Stop, stop, you, plumber. stop, stop, stop. Look, come to the house on Tuesday. See what happens. Let me think about it. All right, all right give me another. <laughs> that can be done. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'll give you, I'll give you a call. We can do something. I didn't say I'd do it. Hey, oh. Give me your number. Yeah, Max, I don't know what I'm thinking. We'll figure it out. It'll be all right, Max. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Good messages. Hey, Rachel, how's your weekend? Spent the entire weekend in the garden. I would have traded with you in a heartbeat. Hey, finally broke a hunt. That's worth a lunch. You buying? Wrong. Good morning. Hi. Hey, Roscoe. Your old friend Tony called. He wanted our email address. He's a good guy. He said we'd enjoy the performance from your reunion. I wanted to surprise you with a recording contract. That's no big deal. The guys playing at the gig were uh, from an old high school band. I joined in with them. Uh huh. Hey, at least we kept our shirts on. Well, the women in the crowd looked very enthusiastic. Really? Maybe I better take a look at that. I might need to hire some security. Did you ever think for one minute? It was spontaneous. Something that you seldom experience. Uh, you know, George, this isn't about me. This is about a, a businessman who decides to embarrass his family. I didn't mean to embarrass anybody. Besides that, I don't believe my family was even there. You always have to have the last word. I guess the tabloids will want interviews with us. <laughs> now I know how Paul McCartney's kids feel. Where'd you see it? Ever heard of YouTube? Oh, that's great. Now everyone can see it. For old guys, you're pretty good. Hello? Lefty. Steve. Hey, Steve. How are you? Hey, good, man. Real good. Hey, listen. You still 
coming over Tuesday? Sure. What time? About 7 o'clock. Hey, I got some unbelievable feedback from our reunion gig. Yeah, I'm getting a couple reviews right now as we speak. No kidding? Yeah. All right, listen. I'm going to email you the directions. Hey, did this guy send you the video? Uh, he sure did. Sounded pretty good, huh? Uh, not bad. All right, listen. I got to go. All right, I'll be looking for your email. All right, we'll see you. Bye. You want to hear something Alan burned for me? I'd love to. What is it? You'll hear. <laughs> nice playing. I like the tune, too. Told you. We're kind of working together on the song. He's not all pierced up, is he? You are so getting old. I swear this is the last fundraiser. We say that every year and come back for more punishment. At least the money gets used in the classroom. Mm -hmm. Ugh. And where the hell is Vicky? It was her idea for us to personally sign each card. Oh, she called and said she's running late. She's got to check up on her dad. I thought there were supposed to be a few years for us to enjoy life in between the time our kids leave for college and our parents' health declines. Hello! In the kitchen. This is the party? Now that you're here? Ah! OK. Catch me up. What did I miss? We were just trying to locate the years when we get to put ourselves first. Do we get those? Because I only got six months. It was right after Julia went to college and right before my father broke his hip. Oh. oh. Have a pen. Thank you. Look at this. You think we can sign all these in an hour? I think it depends on how much caffeine we have. So, how's George? The rock star? <laughs> so did you go? Oh, obviously not. No, you shouldn't have to go to your husband's reunion if you didn't go to the school. I agree. But yeah, they were pretty good, though. I mean, just saying. I hate the internet. The least they could have done was taken their shirts off. <laughs> Men start to regress at 45. Yeah, right when you can pay attention to each other. Yeah, but do we get midlife crises? No. no. Oh, you know what? I'm redoing the condo. Yep, that's one for us. And having a developer for a husband can't hurt with that. Oh, bull, I did everything. I mean, you know, he hasn't been there for months. It's only 45 minutes to get to the beach. No, it's OK. It gives me something to look forward to. You know what I'm looking forward to? When our kids go away to college and we don't have to do this crap anymore. Oh, it's beautiful. my dream. It's a little dream. And when they can support <laughs> us. What was that? I, you know, that was ugly. That's a, look. Oh, yeah. Get the right ball this that's time. That's just right? ugly. Oh, you mean that one right by yeah, the yeah. side pocket? It's a lot of pressure. Okay. Be okay, you got my mic. Hey. You, you, pay me. He's here. Lefty, what's going on? I'm doing all right. I'd probably be a lot better off if somebody hadn't have sent that email to my wife. I'm sorry about that. You want a beer? No. Wine? Something? No. Anything? No, I'm fine. Thanks. My brother. How's the family, bro? Everybody's good. Good. Lord, did I get emails from old loves. You know, some of those loves look pretty old at the reunion. Oh, come on, man. You think we look young? I do. 
Reminded me of Georgie Boy's song, Old What's Her Name. Man, where'd that come from? Way in the back of my head. So how long you been married, Georgie Boy? Going on 20 years. How about yourself? Divorced for 20. Yeah, well, there's the last rocker left. Hey, guys, let's, uh, let's give this a try. Holy shit, man, you didn't have to pick it up quite that fast. I gotta be honest with you. Practiced every day since the reunion. Dedication? No, fear of humiliation. <laughs> oh, shit, man, I gotta fly. What the hell, man? I got a family, asshole. <sighs> That's always something more important. If I want to pick up my kid from baseball practice, I'll do it. No, 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 it's all right, it's all right, it's cool. You just don't get it. When your kids start driving, you're gonna miss that chunk of time with them. I don't have any kids. I know that, asswipe. I was being hypercritical. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. 25 years and nothing's changed. Isn't it great? I'm going to take a piss. Rock stars. Don't uh, fall in. So, Lefty, what do you think? Yeah, why don't we play it by ear? Practice a couple weeks and let's see how things are going. Want we'll to take it one more time out of eight? Is. The car. Oh, it has pockets, Mom. That's so cool. Very cute. Oh, you are beautiful. Oh, I love you. Mm -hmm. I love you too, Mom. Look. Do you like this one? Oh, it's adorable. How do you like it? How do you like it? Well, at least my butt doesn't look like a boat. Oh, you look great. You know what? I have an idea. Why don't we cover you up and keep the animals away? <laughs> you sound like Clog. <laughs> Do you think Pop wishes he would have kept up with his music? He didn't give it up. He still has his guitars, and he listens to music all the time. I'm at the band stuff. You know what? If you have a business and a family, there isn't much time to be in a band. I'm gonna try another dress. Here. Thanks. Basically, we're within 10% of the credit line limit, which makes me nervous. 
We need to pay off some early drawdowns. Well, a number of the units haven't closed, so until then, money's tight. Yeah, I checked with Rachel on the completion schedule. What's delaying it? The usual. Bad weather, late material delivery. I'll get with her at the site this afternoon. It's going to become a bigger problem if I don't address it now. This is the settlement suggested by the arbitrator and the supplier grievance. Oh, boy. Now, I went over it with Bob Carlson, and we feel it's time to cut our losses. Can't afford to fight for the principle of the thing. George, we've been together for 15 years. We have a lot of really good people here. You've got to let them do their jobs. What do you mean? They have key roles? Yes, but you're involved in every decision, and they're getting frustrated. Some of these delays were caused because they were afraid to make a decision on their own. Give them the authority and make them accountable. If you don't, we'll eventually lose the best ones. Maybe I'm afraid they just won't need me. Well, the theory goes that an entrepreneur who starts a business isn't necessarily the best person to take it to the next level. Be a shame to spend all these years and end up with nothing. That it would. So, you know, I was thinking something like that for the verses, right? And we'd like... Mm -hmm. What do you think about the chorus? Well, I was thinking to go into it, we'd start with like something like the C, the G minor, something like that. eavesdropping. Sorry, it's completely unintentional. Sure. Hi, Dad. Hey. This is Alan. Hey, nice to meet you. I've nice heard a lot about you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Burton, yeah. Hey, so Ellie says uh, you got a pretty cool guitar collection. I've got a few, yeah. I'd love to see him sometime. Well, have Ellie bring you by the office. I'd like to show him to you. Okay. Cool, yeah. Hey, that's the tune you played me. Yeah. Yeah, we're just trying to work it out, you know? You got a nice touch on that guitar. Oh, thank you, man. I've been playing since I was, like, seven. It shows. Thanks. Nice. Yeah, I saw your, uh, your little video on, on YouTube. Oh, no. No, you're really good, man. It's cool. We're a little rusty, to be honest with oh, you. No, yeah. no. Listen, I'll let your kids get back to making music anyway. Hey, was that y your old band? I mean, they stayed together since high school, huh? No, they've only been back together about five years now. No. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry. I, I got to run or else I'm going to be late for my lesson. Oh, really? How long have you been taking them? Uh, actually, uh, I, I give them, so. Impressive, huh? Well, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you, too. I'll we'll see you again. Yeah, okay. Bye. <laughs> so, what'd you think? He seemed like a nice guy, but he's a musician, so... <laughs> he just moved here with his family, like, a year ago. I met him in class. Well, I can relate to that. We moved to Oceanside when I was about 13 years old. So in high school, my dad wanted to be a rock star and a songwriter? Reverse us. Got a dream. <laughs> so you gonna play with them again? Might be fun. Then Grandma would say do it. Yeah, but we both know Grandma's about half crazy. <laughs> oh, that's where you get it from. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta put it on with authority. Try not to cut this one. Whoa! Oh, nice shot. Just, all right. You're just cheating, don't you? All right. Excuse <laughs> me. Thick. Excuse me. Let a man work here. Uh, may I interrupt for some exciting news? Not right oh. now, Freddie. I'm kicking his ass. Come like on. Like what, Freddie? 
Like, uh, I booked you guys two weeks from Saturday at Bay Sounds in San Diego. No, you did. Yes. Are you serious? Very nice. It's very cool, because that's not an easy gig to get. Lord have mercy. We done finally made the big city. <laughs> Unbelievable. Now, you set this up, Georgie boy? Are you kidding me? If I did, I wouldn't do it where I live. You know, I've been doing this for a while, dickhead. Yeah, sure you have, old timer. Hey, you know what? Good job, Freddy. Yeah, That's right. Job. Well done. Thank well you. Well done. Right. Well done. Damn it. Yeah, maybe uh, Georgie Boy can shoot some emails out to some of his rich friends and clients, huh? Sorry, but I don't like to mix business and pleasure. Hey, this is my business, Georgie Boy. Hey, hey, hey come on. Hey, Give it a rest. Hey, this could be a good gig for all of us. But, George, Tony tells me you have some original tunes. But maybe you could play one at Bass Sounds. You guys want to have a go at old What's Her Name? Yeah, we could do that. Let's do it. We could do that. Yeah, old What's Her Name. The ball's hit deeply down the right field line. Matzak makes a back in his way. Spins and fires the third, and he's out. They got him as they're trying to stretch. You know, it's one thing to practice with your old band, but to play in a bar here? You want everyone to know you're in a crisis? No, it's a crisis. Yeah. A midlife crisis. Oh, it's crap. I love music. I've always loved music, and you know that. What's it hurt if I have a little fun with it? Besides that, you won't have to pay to hear this. I am not joking. Well, maybe you're the one with a crisis. We're in a rut. Oh, there you go. Walk away and hope it goes away. Well, maybe you'd like to go away. Don't flip this around on me. Look, I'm making a little music for the fun of it. <sighs> Ugh. I've never heard you guys here before. Uh, you'd have had to have been born a long time ago to have heard us play together. Let's just say it's our first gig in quite a while. Oh, yeah? Well, then you've been practicing really hard. Thank you. Did Freddie book you? Yeah. 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 You know Freddie well? He's an acquaintance. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. You must be in the music business. Actually, I used to work in radio, and so, you know, you run into people. Yeah. yeah. That's true. That's true. <laughs> oh! Oh, my! Oh! <laughs> Did I hurt you? Not a bit. Oh, that's Not good. <laughs> Let me get that hair out of you. Thank you. I'm chewing you. on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, well, oh. anyway. Where to? Uh, home. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, home. Yeah. 
It's nice to meet you, though. We'll see you next time. Okay, Lefty. I got this. I got this. That's hey. great. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Hey. Kate, nice to. Yeah. Hi, Kate. Yeah, we're gonna have to have this redone. Okay. You see, this is this spot is supposed to be upstairs. Nothing like getting squeezed by the bank, the contractors, and the clients all at once. I believe that sucks as much as it possibly could. Yeah. If it wasn't for reality, life would be great. Speaking of reality, where are we on the green aspects of the corporate project? Well, right now, we're locked for leadership in energy and environmental design certification. Always a bullcrap name. <laughs> are we in budget? Yeah. But if we go for gold or platinum levels, it will add 10 or 15%. Of course. Uh -huh. Well, it gets into geothermal heating, solar panels, green roofs. So now we need to hire a landscaper for the roof? <laughs> we may have to pull people or resources off other projects. You need to make sure everyone understands the priorities. Look, don't worry. We know the business. Glenn's with you on this. You make sure to remember us when you're famous. <laughs> Good luck. I need it. <laughs> To be honest with you, Mom, I thought we sounded pretty good. Oh, your father would rather go to church than to hear you play music. <laughs> Come on now. We weren't that bad, were we? Oh, just a little bit too loud. Yeah, let me help you with that. No, I'm not helpless. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Oh, he was proud of you when you won that radio contest. That's good to know. But he could have been more understanding of your world. He did what he was wired to do. Mm -hmm. Sorry you always got put in the middle of everything. <laughs> a mother is the middleman of a family. Hey, how would you like to run interference with Pam? Uh -uh. She doesn't want her nice life interrupted, darling. <laughs> Whew. You're tough. No, I'm just realistic. I don't have much time left to dilly-dally around. Oh, come on, Ma. You're gonna be here a long time. Oh, Georgie, you know that's bull. Time is flying by. What helps you live longer is enjoying it. And I am enjoying it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You always have. You know, my greatest joy is Ellie. I love her visits. She'll be going off to college soon. Don't worry. I've been reading they come back after they graduate. <laughs> Afternoon, Margie. Hey, George. How's it going, Doc? Uh, good, good. Hey, are you able to keep up with her? Never could. Uh, OK, time to get back to work. Anything you say. Well, it's obvious who's in charge around here. Have you time for a quick checkup? Absolutely not. I am playing Texas Hold'em in 15 minutes. So you'll have to come another day. Sorry. Wish me luck. <laughs>
Are you kidding? That was fun. Nasty. Woo. Hey, Freddie. You guys are sick. Thank you. Yeah, Freddie. I think everybody's happy. Yeah, I think you guys will be, too. OK. You all right? You got us. What's up? Uh, where's Willie? Oh, who cares? Well, uh, Sir Frederick has an offer on the table for Encore to open for the Classic Rock Tour next Friday at the Gardens. You're bullshitting me. No. The opening act had a contractual snafu, and uh, they're out of it for now. Uh, Freddie, have you been smoking anything that we should know about? I'm just asking. No, I have not. This is legit. Is he for real? Looks like he is. She's like, <laughs> that's it. Oh, this, this is insane. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Freddie. This was great. serious. Good job, my man. Oh, congratulations are in order. How could you tell? Huh? Maybe I'm psychic. Congratulations. Freddie came through with a nice one. Really? That's great. Good. Hey, this is Freddie. Freddie, well, give me, give me, give me. Did I miss something? Freddie has plugged us into a classics gig at the gardens. Well, don't get too excited. Well, how'd that happen? In the right place, right time. What, did uh, Georgie boy here bring us some good luck? Well, you guys have earned this. Damn right, we have. <laughs> All right, hey, let's celebrate, you know? Hey, Georgie boy can buy us another round, huh? He's loaded. Looks like you're loaded, too. <laughs> you know what, actually, I think we're OK. Why don't you go have another Cosmo, and we'll Go pack up. He loves yeah. that thing. You know what? I gotta call Sherry. Call Sherry. We're gonna She's start packing. Up. You're gonna need to keep an eye on that Willie guy. No, it's not. Well. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hey, Christine. Who is she? Who sent you this? George, who is she? She's a friend of Freddy's. Well, from what I see, she is a friend of yours. Don't be ridiculous. Everybody was excited. And kissing. I mean, married men do not hang out in bars kissing strange women. You're overreacting. Are you going to tell me it's all about the music? Is that so hard to believe? Not if you're 16 years old. Let's just talk about this tonight. Hi. Music's just a release for me. I thought you wanted to talk about it tonight. It's an escape. From me? From everything. <sighs> Dad, how can you do this to Mom? It's not fair. I just saw the pictures. Yeah, but it's not what you think. It matters what Mom thinks. Well, it matters what you think, too, honey. Everybody was just excited and celebrating. It's nothing. Sure looks like something. Honey, I'm telling you, I hardly knew the woman. Oh, and that makes it better? You know what I meant. Somebody's just trying to make me look bad. Guess it worked. It's just about the music, Gail. Your mom and I got some problems, but we're just going to work our way through them. Guys, the promoter liked the fact that you had some original songs. Yeah, where'd that come from? He was there the other night, and he liked what he heard. Something is happening here. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, uh, what do you got? Uh, right now? Uh, squat. Well, unless we can get Lefty to pull a few out of the archives. I don't know, Gus. What do you mean you don't know? We had fun with him back in the day. <sighs> that was the day. A lot of things have changed. I don't know if they hold up now. That's the thing about music, Lefty. Good music never dies. Wait, hold on a second. Do you guys actually realize what we're considering here? Oh, come on. Willie, man, where's your vision? We, can, we got a chance to make something happen. Man, we got nothing to lose. Steve. What? Can you afford to take the time it's going to take? Me? Hell, I'm a plumber. Nobody expects me to show up anyway. I haven't taken time off in a while. The computers can wait. Well, mine's been in your shop for two weeks. Yeah, well, most don't come saturated in vodka. Scotch. Michael? Well, you know, I, uh, 
I'm gonna have to talk it over with my wife. Oh, Christ, here we go. You know, Willie, if you had a relationship with something other than that guitar, you might understand something about human relationships. Oh, come on, guys, cool then. Listen, like, check with Sherry and your boss. We'll go from there. Yeah, you guys, these, these guys are gonna be expecting you to lay down some tracks. What? You mean they don't trust us that our new stuff is good? No, I don't think so. Well, screw it. I ain't gonna do it. I quit. Guys, maybe I could go through some of our old demos. All right, yeah. there we go. You still got those, man? Okay, what do you say we meet Wednesday night? You good with that, Lefty? Sure. I'm in. All right, I'm back in the band. I'll tell you something. If there's not anything good in there, I ain't screwing with it. Oh, well, shit. I guess that just leaves us with your stuff. Hey, screw you, man. Hey, buy me dinner first, sweetheart. Oh, on, hey! Good. Willie's right. It's about the music. Given any more thought to the tour? Oh, yeah. Even when I should be thinking about other things. Your business? Yeah, it's got a lot going on right now. Do this for you. Some might say I've done everything for me. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. Just got a lot of changes going on right now. It's up with the family. The ones who love you will understand. You never get back missed opportunities. Thanks for the session. Maybe I'll see you at the next gig. I'll look forward to it. OK. Bye. Try not to blink when you're bluffing. <laughs> Is that why they wear sunglasses on the TV poker we've been watching? Oh, I knew you'd catch on. <laughs> Mom will crow because she knew I was learning poker. Well, your dad made his college spending money that way. For real? You bet. I'm gonna charge you for less. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. It's not on your cards. I bet you are never afraid of anything. Oh, we're all afraid of things. What were you most afraid of when you were 10? Um, I don't know. Snakes. And you probably still are. It's a physical thing you think is threatening to you, huh? Over time, you could probably get over it between you and I. Mice still get to me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you, dear. What about something more personal? I guess maybe never having a boyfriend. Oh, but then. <laughs> That's working out OK. There you go. I think mom's afraid. Well, no one likes change, particularly when it has to do with the person you love. But dad hasn't changed. He's just doing something different. Oh, you're right. He hasn't changed. But the day to day routine might. And then you just don't know what's next. Afraid of what might happen? Fear of the unknown. It can paralyze you if you let it. I won't. I just wish that, you know, maybe Dad could try to understand Mom's side. Oh, I know, dear. I know. Things will work out for the best for them. You love them both. And they love you. It's gonna be really freaky watching Dad play. It'll be for him, too. Give him a kiss for me. <laughs> <laughs> Not deal. You. You're crazy. You think? 
think you're a rock star, huh? That would be crazy. You know, one day you are going to regret this. I regret some things already. Oh, yeah? What do you have to regret? This didn't have to become such a big deal. You made it a big deal. No. We did this together. A little at a time. We got lazy. Just took the smoothest road. You wanted it bumpy. That's not the point. I gave in on everything. Everything? Like what? Not where we live. Not your job. What? On life. I just went through <laughs> the motions. Watched it flying by. That's not my fault. No. It's mine. Where is everybody? All right, where is he? He'll be here for the last set. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, and, and he liked the CD. Great. He did. He liked it. He yep. liked it. Is he here yet? He'll. He'll be here. He'll be here. I feel like a kid on an audition. Butterfly soup, huh? Yeah. I got to take this. Hey, guys, look. All we got to do is keep doing what we're doing. It's going to be all right. And we need to end it with one that really rocks out the house. We? What's your problem, Will? Yeah, I'll tell you what my problem whoa, is, whoa, old man. Whoa, I do not care about you. Shut up. You're shut not up, on the stage. This is my band. Get him out of here, Steve. I'm getting him out of here. Damn it. We're in on this together, and Freddie made it happen. Shut up. Don't get Get out of here. You out of pocket, Willie. Hey, you're a damn baby, sir. Get out of here. Who's damn running this show? What are you guys going to do about him? Everything okay? How's the crowd? Hold on, let me step out here where I can hear you. It's so dang loud here. So you were saying? Great, play yet? Yeah, we got two sets down and one to go. That's the one the promoter's coming to. <laughs> You'll score, but I've got a request. Oh yeah, what is it? Remember to play the one you wrote for the guy who worked with Grandpa at the steel mill? It rocked, I'd love it. You say so. You can do it. Kick their butts, Pop. Hey, I got an academic achievement award for being on the honor roll every term. You should be so proud. I'm sorry I wasn't there. Uh, I guess I'll let you off the hook for this one. You're amazing, you know that? Bye. 
Paul said, Mac, I need to see you. It's Friday afternoon about five. We had to make some cuts around here. Sorry, Mac, you won't survive. We sat there stunned in silence. Hard words ringing in his ears. Couldn't believe all the years he had given. Suddenly it disappeared. His first thought was, how do I tell her? But I lost my job today. As he left, he felt so wounded. And his boss just looked away. He wondered, where's the justice? When I gave it everything I got. Driving home with fire kicked in And I'm feeling sorry for himself just died He said I ain't gonna go The way I thought about the road I will not go quietly the way that they want us to be Driven from the only life we know Ever had to find a brand new land. We ain't gonna go the way I'm not about to go. No, we will not go quietly the way that they want us to be driven from the You guys are sounding really good. Freddie, I want to help you with this. Oh, I'll, I'll figure something out. No, it's not a problem. I mean, you're gonna need some tour support, you need to burn some discs, keep you from being into the promoter. Well, that would be smart. Then it's done. Listen, I'll call you tomorrow. And if you could, just keep this between us. Oh, right. Lefty. So that's it. You've decided without discussing it? This wouldn't be discussing it. Uh, not when you've already made plans. These guys have worked their whole life and never got close once. I can't let them down. Well, what about me? That's not fair, Pam. I backed you in everything you've done. I mean, even in the toughest of times, it was good because we were together. You wanted to renovate that beach house. I wasn't so hot on it, but I didn't stop you. Well, I thought you might have shown a little interest in something I was doing. I deal with contractors every single day of my life. Besides, that was your thing. You made that clear. But I was doing something I loved. It's a few lousy shows. George, this isn't a one-time deal. I know you. And so you're, you're going to risk everything for a, a teenage dream? I just realized something. We've been married 20 years. I don't even know if you have a dream. Of course I do. I, I have a family, and we're secure. You have that. And you had that before us, too. You've always had a safe, sheltered life. <laughs> but if you have something, it's not a dream. Let me ask you, you going to be happy 20 years from now when you look back? just to go out on the road like that without a thought? Oh, he gave it a thought. Yeah, it was a selfish thought. I mean, I, I know he loves music, but a band? 
you even know these guys? No. I mean, you know, maybe they came to the wedding. I, I don't know. That one guy looked really sleazy online. Yeah. You know, when I met George, I, he was open to anything. He was comfortable with anyone. And we would go to the worst part of town and watch blues bands. You know, and, and I was attracted to him then. And now it's, it's not so appealing. It'll all work out. I don't know if I wanted to. Pamela, are you thinking about leaving George? What would you do? You know, stay home till Ellie finishes school. And then you could come visit me here all the time. Well, it's beautiful. You've done a fabulous job. It's relaxing, and the wine's always good. I think we should talk you out of this. Okay, I haven't made any decisions yet. Besides, you asked. Yeah, well, now I wish I'd get my big mouth shut. I really think you guys could get some solid bookings. That's a fantasy. We could play the same old venues, maybe front some reunion tours, but the music business is for the young. Hmm. Or an anomaly. Well, the guys don't think so. Freddie doesn't think so. I don't. Yeah. This validates them. Nobody can take that away from them. As for me, it's what I always wanted to do. And I'm enjoying the hell out of it. Hmm. If this can't go anywhere, then I need to walk away now. Just life's a little crazy right now. The tour, my business, Ellie needs time. You make me feel guilty for even thinking of it. <laughs> Another time, who knows? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good Best songs come from the heart. Yeah. 
everything I am because of you. You are my sunshine, my wind, and my rain. Girls, come on in. I want you to meet the band. Cool. Oh, thanks for the tickets, Mr. Barron. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, great seats. My parents are jealous. Cool, cool. This is Freddie. Freddie's the manager. This is my daughter, Ellie, and her Hi, friends. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, and that's Steve. Hi, Steve plays the guitar. Steve, that's my daughter, Ellie, and her buddy. Hey, Ellie. How are you? Yeah. Look at this. She's got your hair. <laughs> She's a beautiful daughter. Yeah, which is why she ought to be leaving real quick. <laughs> I don't suppose you want Freddie to take him home, do you? <laughs> That's Michael. He's the drummer and the jokester in the band. He's a meet you. And that right there is Tony. He plays the bass. Tony, you. you're much too old for her. Oh, she knows that. I know that too, Papa. <laughs> I think bass players are timeless. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry. Good. Truth from youth. Hey, where's that cute guitar player? Um, I think we better be going. I bet your mom's outside waiting on you. Come on, okay. let's go. Bye. All right. Bye. 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 <laughs> Boy, you are way too sober, bro. You need some more of this. Yeah, yeah you need some more, too, huh? There's plenty. Well, he's got all you need. <laughs> Thanks for finally writing my song. I mean, every word of it. <laughs> Thanks again, Mr. V. It was really fun. Bye, I like cat. Bye. It was amazing. Thank you. Thanks for coming. See you next time. Bye. 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 Love you, Bye. Bye. I love you. I know you didn't expect to see me here. Not really. I suppose I just wanted to see what it was all about. Any revelations? Actually, you guys were good. <laughs> a bunch of old farts. <laughs> yeah, really? Do you ever think we'd be here? Not in a million years. I guess we just want different things. Yeah. You know, uh, my business problems didn't have anything to do with the band. No, no. If, if I thought that, we'd really be in trouble. Yeah. I guess, it's, you know, the business cycle is just like a great big roller coaster. You know, sometimes I think you enjoy the ride. I guess so. Fear of the unknown. It's always exciting. <laughs> well, um, Sheila sent Carlson the papers. Yeah. He called me and we went over everything. Looks good. Thanks for not taking my guitars. Or my dog. I did on my shoes. <laughs> yeah. So, um, maybe I can rent the condo off of you sometime. You know, to be with Ellie. Uh. Does she seem okay to you? Yeah, um, you know, she, she deals with things pretty good. Yeah. You made a great kid. Sorry. No. Kind of. It's okay. Me too. No, but up until then, we were pretty good. Yeah. Very good. Hey! <laughs>
Hey, Georgie boy, you got some young ones, huh? You've been up my ass since day one. Prince Georgie, I didn't bow down like everyone else. You need to get your groupies and get the hell out of here. Hey, Prince! Damn it, all right, all right, all right, OK. You just pissed off at the world because you could have been so much more. Screw you, Georgie girl. Oh, hey! Jesus oh. Christ, all right! Oh. Easy. Oh, what is up stop. with you two? Hey, I'll tell you what, he can do what he wants, but we can't have these young girls back here in our dressing room. Hey, you just try it, Georgie. Hey, you just try it. Come on. Man. This shit can't happen. This shit can't happen. Oh. You can't self-destruct, man. This is not just about you. You get that? No, you get no. that shit? No, if he wants to mess this up, that's fine. But I'm not gonna stand by and just watch. Yeah, take a hike. Then. That's enough. What the hell are you guys doing? We got a bit of a problem. No, there's no problem. One of us goes and that's it. See ya. Well, you've been pulling this crap for years. You really feel that way? What the hell are you still doing? At least I give a damn. Yeah, well, I don't know what you want, man. I, I don't know what you need. Now, if you think you're so far beyond us, maybe you should go so. I'm out of here. Out of here. All right. We're gonna be fine. I'm sorry, guys. No, no, no. It's all right. It was. It was time. He was out of here anyway. You know, whoever we get, they're gonna have to match Willie Boy. Yeah, 215 now. Thanks. You guys got a problem? Yeah, it was not your problem. You kind of made it my problem. About the music, I left it. Take him to this address. It's all about the music. You know, he never would have made it in Nashville. We have a problem. Hey, maybe we can find a lead guitarist on Craigslist. And make sure he's an AA guy. Tough to find when they're anonymous. <laughs> maybe we should try manic depressive this time. I think Willie was manic depressive. Oh, yeah, you're right. Where you been at? Uh, lefty needed some air. I'm sure your cigar helped. <sighs> well, gang, we haven't got time to do a background check, so I would say if anybody knows anybody, like if your nanny plays guitar, you should uh, probably get on it before we're completely screwed. That's a tough one, but uh, I'll check around. You know what? I may have someone to consider. All right, there you go. Let's make some phone calls. I'll see who's playing on the street corner out here, and we'll bring in our best option this week. Oh, we've gone this far, so I'll go with whoever works. Yeah, lucky we only have one more gig. Yeah. Good cheering up, Freddy. Thanks. Yeah. Let's go pack up. <laughs> See you. Must have been fate.
These documents give us an opportunity to become equity partners. Well, this is unexpected. Well, I can assure you, a lot of thought has gone into it. Now, we're bonus the initial share, so there's no cost. Essentially, I'm phasing myself out. But this is your baby. She's all grown up. It's just a lot of things coming together all at once. And besides, I wouldn't do this if I didn't have total confidence in all of you. Glenn. Sure. Look, I've been here a while. But the goal has never changed. Create a business where we could enjoy our work and make some money. I think we've been relatively successful. But now it's time for us to take it from here. This is George. I'll miss her. So will I. I remembered something. Forgot. She asked me to do that before the concert. Glad you saved it for now. He's got that shit eating grin. Come on, Freddy, you're not too subtle. Well, come on, let me enjoy this for a while. Oh, Freddy, come on, give it up, would you please? Is that a, a new tune? Yeah, it's from our young blood. Hey, nice sound. Uh, any lyrics? Oh, we're working on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> come on, Freddy, give it up. We're trying to rehearse here. <laughs> All right, wait, wait, wait. All right, all right. <clears throat> here we go. <laughs> Encore, local band of old and renowned, has been picked up for the next leg of the tour. Oh, well, dates. Leave yes. them. For yes. real, Fred. Oh, my God. And this is crazy. This is due to my efforts, of course, and Miss Kate Starkey, who put you on the radar with the uh, promoter. Man. This is cool. Oh, this is so, cool. so, gentlemen, Man. gentlemen, what is it about? It's, it's about, about the, the music! music. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. This next song's a song that I co-wrote with my youngest member of the band over here. The only guy under 40. As a matter of fact, the only guy under 20, I believe. <laughs> Give it up for Alan, ladies and gentlemen. You know, got a little bit of help from my uh, left-handed mentor here on the lyrics and uh, lots of help from his beautiful daughter. Thank you. It's bottles and beers, rattles and cribs. 3 a.m.s again and again Comfort to cry Man, it's flying by Swings and slides and tricycle rides Skinning up knees and falling out of trees It's like it's never gonna end But it's flying by You better hold on tight To those little lights In the blink of an eye It's out of sight I know, I know It goes so slow but it's flying by Then it's braces and boots And bad attitudes Boys and fawns And ever-changing mood Trying times, man 
choose your life And it's supposed to be home at 10 You're late again, where the heck you been? When you're yelling and screaming, it don't seem like it's flying by But it's flying by You better hold on tight To those changing lives In the blink of an eye, they're out of sight No, I know it seems so slow, but it's flying by. There they go on their own, flying by. You're waving goodbye with the tears in your eye. I know, I know it goes so slow, but it's flying by. They come back home. What do you know? Them kids have got some kids of their own. You can't believe how much they've grown and where the time's gone. You look in the mirror, spray in your hair. You're wondering how in the world did that get there? It just ain't fair how it's flying by. You better hold on tight to that sweet, sweet life. In the blink of an eye, you're out of sight. I know, I know, it goes so slow, but it's flying by. There's hospital beds, last word said, did I do enough? Holding hands and being there for the leaving. It's a line of cars parked on a hill, family and friends perfectly still. A prayer and a song as they lower it down into the ground. You better hold on tight It's a short, short life In the blink of an eye It's out of sight I know, I know It seems so slow Yeah, it seems so slow But it's flying by Enjoy the ride It's flying by
Changing colors that I never could Just for something more, but never.